Hello everyone, welcome to Design Mind channel. Today I am going to explain compare two word document and find difference between two word documents. Okay, let me show you. This is document one and this is document two. I'm just taking as an example. Okay, so let me show you side by side review to see the difference. Okay, then I am going to show you that is an easy way to compare the document and the changes that is being added by comparing the document 1 and document 2. So basically it's the same content and you can find the format differences and uh, some uh, minor additional content in the document 2 uh, comparing with the document 1. So instead of checking manually what are all the new additions and changes uh, in the document 2 by comparing the document 1. So we, we have an option in the word uh, which we can check uh, the changes and uh, each and every changes uh, using that option. Okay. So let me show you how to uh, use that uh, comparing the document option. So first let me open the word document 1. Okay. Then go to review tab okay you see compare if you click on the compare document it will open the pop-up window which you have to choose the original document and also the revised document okay so original document i'm going to choose document one and the revised document i'm going to choose document two okay it's just the author name so don't worry if you click ok then it will give you the comparison between the document 1 and document 2. See, this is document 1 and this is document 2 and all these changes will be showing here like a track changes. Okay, so if you double click it, you will see what is the changes exactly uh, was done for the respective document. Okay, first changes, the document 1 is replaced with number 2. Okay. Then, if you double click this, the formatting changes, here it is italic and here the italic has been removed. If you click on the next formatting, here it is bold, document 2 it is bold and document 1 it is not bold. So you can check all these changes one by one and here you see there is a deletion. So you can compare one by one Okay, and you have to click one by one accept and move to the next to changes like the track changes I explained in my previous video okay so if, if this changes is not <coughs> correct then you can reject the changes and move on to the next changes okay so once you verified all these changes uh, that is being uh, uh, done in the document too and you verified everything is fine you simply have to click accept all changes in the document or if you want to <coughs> accept the changes one by one just click on it accept changes you see it is automatically changed then the next one is you can click on next accept the changes click accept and move to next you see italic accept changes okay so as i said earlier once you um, um, find with the changes in the document too all you have to click in one shot accept all changes in the document so which will automatically translate all the, the changes in the document 2 into the document 1. You see the document 2 it has a bold and the green text and the formatting big font with underline okay whereas the document 1, document 1 doesn't have any bold and everything. So these changes is automatically translated into the document 2 okay. Now the final step is you have to save this document which will allow you to save this document as a new document which you can say document 1 and 2 updated save the document that's it you can close you can open the document I'm gonna close everything close everything I'm gonna open the document go to the view Check the print layout, 
Now you will see the final document with the changes that is being updated in the document too. So that is all. It's very easy to compare with any number of document. Okay. I mean, sorry, just a two document. Okay. Easily, instead of uh, proofreading uh, manually one by one, you can use the option under the review, use the compare option. Okay. So thank you for watching this video. Please feel free to reach me out if any clarification through the comment or the, through the email. Okay. Please like my video and share my video and subscribe to my channel to see more videos. Thank you so much.